explode in line with the advocacy called political abolitionism, which is the advocacy of peace and lawful abolition of all dictatorships, anarchical regimes, and despotic regimes all over the world or all over this whole world. I advocate the or I'm advocating that the current British monarch should abdicate from the throne and pave the way for real and actual democracy in Britain because the democracy right now that the British have is elevated in many ways. The royalists still have so many privileges as compared to the privileges of regular people in Britain. And also, uh, the Queen of England or the Queen of Britain is also the head of state of such, uh, I call, as those states which I call as ceremonial colonies of Britain, like Australia, Canada, New Zealand. Jamaica, Bahamas, etc., etc. The head of state of such lands or ceremonial colonies of Britain is Queen Elizabeth II. The Windsors are white. So, uh, as long as such system prevails, wherein the British monarch would be considered as the head of state, although it's only in, this, in the ceremonial status. That ceremonial uh, status uh, solely belongs to the white because the Windsors or the royal house where Queen Elizabeth II comes from, such royal house is made up of white people. So the head of state of such ceremonial would always be a white person. Such would be seemingly unfair, or such is seemingly unfair to those people who are the original inhabitants of Australia, Canada, New Zealand, etc., etc., uh, including Jamaica and Bahamas. So the head of the state of such land would be uh, Queen Elizabeth II, who is the head of state of such land should abdicate from her position as the head of state of such ceremonial colonies of Britain. That is one way of paving the way for actual racial equality in all the, in all throughout the world. Uh, that would pave the way for uh, giving an Australian aborigine opportunity to become a head of state or to become the head of state of Australia by being elected as Australia's president or by being elected as uh, the actual head of state of Australia. So, the people of such ceremonial colonies of Britain should peacefully and lovely struggle to ask Queen Elizabeth II and any other British monarch to abdicate from the position of being their head of state so that racial equality would truly happen in all of those uh, ceremonial colonies of Britain, and all of the ceremonial colonies would be truly sovereign after the abdication of the Queen of England or the Queen of Britain from her position as head of state of those lands. I wish racial equality for all of this. I wish racial equality would 